I'm going to show you how to create this type of editing on Pixel Lab. Now let's start a new project. Delete this default test. Now that you've deleted your default test, you bring in the image you've downloaded. This is a PNG image. So click on import. Once you click on import, you select the image you've downloaded. So you bring it in like this. And then you adjust to the size you want let's say you are going to have it this way so you can centralize it by clicking middle adjustment so now let's type our j test you click on test you write your j let's write j so once you click j increase the size bring it here now you need to select the font i'm going to use a big deal a big deal so you select the font a big deal you can download that so now bring it somewhere around here then you give it a shadow once you activate shadow go to offset x move it to the left a bit you can also adjust your offset y a bit now that you have this you can just click on this j copy it directly for you to have the same size and the same effect so bring it here like this edit it the next test is you letter u so click here bring it here balance it very well now copy it again bring it here edit it repeat the process and type your m which is the next test now the next test is p copy it edit it delete this one just like we've done earlier so bring it here balance it very well now that you have your jump you need to adjust the jump by changing the position so that it will be very perfect now bring this one here adjust it to where you want it to be now go to copy once you copy the image it will appear over it bring it exactly on that same position exam exact position now that you have the exact position you will notice that the leg is still over the first test and the second test now you need to go to mask go to mask click on mask enable the mask now that you've enabled the mask you need to click on this part click on this one so once you click on this exact tool in your pixel lab you'll be able to move this mask to any place you want it to be once you move it to the exact place it should be you click activate you click the activate if you click it you are done and that is it you can now give it a background depending on what you want it can be any color that you want your preferred color